Hey boys, it's Arm None. Today we're going to be customizing the brand new Emperor Vector in Grand Theft Auto Online. Super hyped to get into this. This is based off of a Lexus RCF in real life. It's a very cool car. Let's hop in. All right, guys, so starting off with the armor, we're going to go all the way up on that, of course, the brakes as well. Now for bumpers, we have front and rear options. We have the secondary stock bumper, the arc bumper, secondary arc bumper, rally bumper, secondary rally bumper, performance bumper, whoa, okay, secondary performance bumper, track bumper, or the secondary track bumper. Honestly, I kind of like it with like the stock grill look. So I don't know if I'm actually gonna change it to be honest. I, I think it looks like pretty good like this. The secondary color could maybe be a play, but mm, no, I don't think so. For the rear bumpers, we have the street bumper, the secondary street bumper, the racer bumper, secondary racer, skid bumper, carbon skid bumper, GT bumper, carbon GT, or the super bumper. That's insane. Um, I kind of want to go for something like the like the racer bumper. That's that's clean in my opinion. So we're gonna go for that one. Next up for the engine. Oh, we can change the engine block, so we can add a primary intake, secondary intake, chrome intake, or a carbon intake. Let's go for the chrome intake. Why not? For the rail covers, we can do an arc rail cover, secondary arc rail cover, rev rail cover, secondary rev rail cover, trail rail covers, secondary. Why did I say trail? Track rail covers, secondary track rail covers, APX rail covers, secondary as well, racer rails, oh, rhino rail covers, that's cool. I like the rhino, honestly. Um, let's go for the rhino, why not? For the strut brace, uh, you guys have probably already seen all of these. There's some, I think there's some that are specific to this car, actually. Like, I think, I think the arc strut brace might be specific to this car, so I think I'm going to go for that one. Engine tunes, we're going to go all the way up, of course. For the exhaust, we can add the anodized exhausts, oval exhaust, slash cut exhausts, twin round exhausts, or titanium box exhausts. Um, I definitely feel like the slash cut or the oval. I think it's going to be the oval. For the fenders, we can add arc fenders, carbon arc fenders, performance fenders, or carbon performance fenders. Those are pretty insane looking to me. I kind of like the stock fenders, to be honest. It's like it's a, it's a cool look. Don't get me wrong. Um, you know what? Uh, I no, I like the stock fenders. I'm just gonna keep them. Next up, we got the headlight covers. We can add primary headlight covers, secondary headlight covers, red headlight glass, green, blue, yellow, or iridescent. We're gonna go for iridescent. I like that look the best out of all of those. Next up for the hood, we got hood accessories, chrome hood catches, angled hood pins, latch hood pins, blue latch, red latch, gold latch. We can add a hood bra or a GT hood bra. Not really feeling any of it, to be honest. I don't really like hood catches, so we're just going to leave it off. For the hood, though, we can add a secondary stock hood, carbon stock hood, vector hood, secondary vector hood, carbon vector hood, vented hood, secondary vented, carbon vented, Street hood, secondary street, carbon street, racer hood, secondary racer hood, let me guess, carbon racer hood, yep, carbon racer hood, rally hood, secondary and carbon as well, skid hood, secondary and carbon as well, or back to none. I think, honestly, I kind of like the skid hood. Uh, actually, I don't know if I do. I like the rally hood though. Let's go for the rally hood. That looks pretty good in my opinion. Next up, we got the interior. Now this stuff is all the same on all the new cars. We can add a street interior, a carbon dash and stripped interior, or a flocked dash and stripped interior, or we can leave it stock. Honestly, I like the stock interior. I'm just gonna leave it alone. For the doors, you can add aluminum panels, weave panels, carbon panels, flocked panels, lightweight, aluminum, lightweight weave, carbon weave, or lightweight flocked panels. Again, I'm just gonna leave the interior full. For the seats though, we will be changing those. Let's go for something like uh, the carbon bucket seats. I like those. For the steering wheel, there's a bunch of different options. I do like the stock steering wheel on this thing though, a lot. So I think I'm actually just gonna leave the stock one because it's got carbon fiber paddles, that's sick. 
For the roller cage, we can add one, of course, we can go for the street half cage, secondary street half cage, racer roller cage, secondary as well, padded full, secondary full, reinforced, or the padded reinforced. Um, that's insane. I, I don't really want a roller cage in this thing, to be honest, so we're just going to leave it out. For the headlights, we're going to go xenon, of course. For the livery, there's a few different options we have. We can have white stripes, black stripes, speed orange stripes. That's pretty cool, actually. We wang stripes, we wang gold, black premier, green premier, katana. Oh, okay, so that just adds like little things there. Sorry, you guys can't really see that too well. Uh, oh, that's what it looks like, but in black, obviously. Um, looks pretty cool. Not not too bad. Uh, Stance Andreas. That's kind of cool. We're back to none. Honestly, I don't know, like, none of these really stand out to me too much. Although the Wu Wang Gold kind of does stand out to me. Hmm. I just don't, I don't think this car, uh, I, don't, I don't think I want to do a livery on this thing. Next up, we do have the mirrors. We can go secondary or carbon. Let's go carbon. Adds crazy detail to the mirrors. That's actually sick. For the plate, we're going to go yellow and black, of course. For the respray, I do actually really like this thing in white. However, ooh, ooh, why does blue or silver look so good? Okay. Blue or silver might be a uh, consideration we're going to we're going to think about here. Um car also looks really good in like a yellow, to be honest. Uh it's not bad. Uh looks good in blue, of course. Uh all sorts of blue. Ooh, cream actually looks pretty mean on this thing too. Hmm. I honestly, I like blue or silver a lot. We're going to go for that. For the secondary color, what does that even change? Can we even see anything? Not really. I guess we'll go blue or silver on that too. Why not match it up? Does it do the brake calipers? It does do the brake calipers. Okay, let's actually... I feel like a red. I feel like we could do a red on the brake calipers. Why not? For the trim color, oh, this is sick. Okay, uh, let's go, let's go for a red. Let's go for like... Garnet red. Garnet red is a uh, garnet red's a clean, a clean interior color, I think. And of course, the accent color. Uh, I usually go for diamond blue. I'm gonna do the same on this car. The roof. We can go to roof accessories. Okay, we can add a small antenna, secondary small antenna, a fin antenna, secondary fin antenna, carbon fin, fin roof wing. Okay. Secondary and carbon as well. We can add a street wing. Okay, interesting. Uh, secondary and carbon as well. Racer wing. Secondary and carbon as well. We're back to none. Um, let's go for the carbon fin antenna. I, I like that the best. For the roof, we can go for a primary roof if we want to. Secondary roof, inset roof. Secondary inset or carbon inset. We can go for a ridge line roof as well. Or a secondary or a carbon as well. I kind of like the carbon ridge line. We're going to go for that one. Next up for the skirts, we got street skirts, carbon street, race skirts, carbon race. Does that add? Oh, okay, so that does the secondary color a little bit there. That's kind of cool. We got rally skirts, carbon rally skirts, GT skirts, carbon GT, arrow skirts, carbon arrow, painted arrow skirts, speed skirts, carbon speed skirts. Painted speed skirts, track skirts, carbon track, we're back to stock. Hmm, okay, let's see. I don't know, man. They all look pretty good. Um, I do kind of almost like the little red detail on some of them. I feel like it kind of goes because obviously like it shows with the brake calipers and everything. I'm thinking we're going to go for the carbon speed skirts. I kind of like that. For the splitters, we can add a carbon stock splitter. That's actually sick. Arc splitter, carbon arc splitter, sting splitter, carbon sting. We got a rally splitter, carbon rally splitter, racer splitter, carbon racer splitter, drift splitter, carbon drift splitter. Oh, that's, that might have to go on. Okay. Uh, the super splitter as well, or the carbon super splitter, or back to stock. Honestly, the carbon stock splitter, I think, is going to be the uh, the one that we're going to go for here. I think that looks really good. For the spoiler, we can add a low lid spoiler. Carbon low lid spoiler. That's neat. 
primary low lid spoiler, secondary low lid spoiler, ducktail spoiler, carbon ducktail, primary ducktail, secondary ducktail, we can add a arc spoiler, secondary, or oh no, sorry, carbon, primary, secondary, racer, secondary racer, oh, GT spoiler, okay, secondary GT, street spoiler, arrow spoiler, or back to none. You guys know me, we're gonna go for a ducktail. I think we're probably gonna go for the primary ducktail or maybe the carbon. Let's go for the carbon. Add a little more red accent to the car, why not? We can add a sun strip if we want to. Not really feeling it though. Uh, I'm gonna leave it off. For the suspension, oh my God, you can camber this thing out. That's actually insane. I did not realize that that was gonna be a thing. Let's go for it, I guess. Actually, you know what? It, it's cool, but like, I think I want to go for sport suspension. This is just too much for me, in my opinion, at least. For the transmission, let's go all the way up, and the turbo as well. The wheels, let's see. Uh, I feel like my favorite rims will sort of work with this thing. Yeah, they look pretty good, I feel like. Let's, let's equip these, and let's, uh, I think we're going to paint them black. Or maybe we should do like a stone silver. I've been doing stone silver a lot recently, actually. Let's go for black. For the tires, we're going to go bulletproof, of course. And last but not least, we got the windows, and we're going to tint those all the way out. So definitely uh, more of a sort of basic customization for this thing. Obviously, you can go like pretty nuts with it, but I kind of want to keep it, uh, you know, a, a little bit basic. Let's take this thing down to the ground. We're going to do a sound test and a review. All right, guys, let's hear this thing. I'm not gonna lie, it sounds a lot better than I remember it sounding. So that's pretty cool. Let's uh, let's make sure we change the stance on this thing to default because I don't want to give it a uh, bad bad handling review. Uh, off the line, this thing is all wheel drive, of course. We're gonna just test that right now. Let's just throw it up against the wall. As you guys can see, all four wheels are in fact spinning. So there you go. Car is all wheel drive. I'm interested to see how this thing's actually gonna perform. So far, so good. Uh, not any understeer that I could detect on that uh, on that first corner, which is you know pretty good, I would say. Let's uh, let's see how it performs, you know, going up the hill. Um, honestly, the car sounds a lot better than I remember it sounding. Uh, so that's you know that's a good thing. It actually sounds like pretty fantastic. I think it has the same sound effect as the Komoda, if I'm not mistaken, or maybe the Jugular. Uh, it sounds sounds kind of like both of those cars to me, to be honest. Um, it feels like a little bit of understeer maybe so far. Uh, we're going to see when we get up to the handling section of the test, but, uh, so far the car feels, I would say pretty good. Uh, there's definitely, definitely not anything wrong with it. That's, that's for sure. Um, at least not yet. I'm interested to see how it uh, tackles. Nice. Good, good driving. Um, I'm interested to see how it tackles the, uh, the handling section here. So let's see. This thing is, of course, all-wheel drive, so it is going to have really good cornering speeds. The back end likes to slide out more than I was expecting. Um, that was completely my fault. That was not the car's fault right there, spinning out. Um, yeah, it's it feels, like, really good. It feels, uh, it feels better than the Calico, to be honest with you. It, uh... It definitely has, I, I want to say, better handling than the Calico. I feel like it has less understeer, which is definitely a good thing. Um, this thing may just be faster than the Calico um, in, in races. I'm not 100% sure, but from my initial uh, assumptions about this thing, I think that it, it just might be a little bit faster than the Calico. Not, you know, not 100% sure, obviously, but... Uh, so far, the car feels absolutely fantastic. The handling of it is really good. Uh, the back end does like to slide out if you uh, if you go too hard with it, but you know, as long as you uh, sort of you know keep it a bit slowed down, it uh, it can definitely handle itself. That's for sure. Um, I'm interested to see what it actually handles like with the suspension all the way lowered. Uh, I want to know if there's much of a difference with it with the low suspension. But uh, the way I've got mine set up right now, I am pretty happy with how this thing is actually performing. Yeah, guys, this thing, this thing's, it's pretty quick, and it handles quite well. 
Um, I'm actually very impressed with this thing, to be honest. Anyway, guys, I think that's pretty much it for the customization and review. I would definitely recommend picking one of these things up if you guys have got the money and the garage space, of course. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments down below. Leave a like if you learned something or if you enjoyed. Dislike if you didn't. Subscribe if you guys are new. And I will see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care. Peace.